Materials are also formulated in the laboratory if outside sources cannot provide plastics needed for specialized functions. The Plastics and Encapsulation Laboratory has more than 20 years' experience in formulating and evaluating materials for the insulation and protection of electronic assemblies. Protected packages withstand tests of high gravity, vibration, heat, salt spray, dust, and other critical environmental conditions. The Inertial Controls Laboratory is precisely oriented toward the development and evaluation of flight control and navigational systems. It is here that gyro and accelerometer components, while subjected to varying environments and operating conditions, are critically examined to determine error coefficients, sensitivity levels, and other factors. An analysis of equipment includes investigation of directional orientation sensitivity, as well as temperature, magnetic field, and operating power effects. Basic equipment includes an ultradex dividing head used for testing pendulous accelerometers and other inertial sensors. This instrument has a position accuracy of one quarter of an arc second. For years, Convair has been prominent in the research, design, testing, and production of complete antenna and solid-state microwave systems for airborne and aerospace vehicles. In addition, radomes and electromagnetic windows for aircraft and missiles are designed and produced at this facility. Capability for conducting developmental work includes five outdoor radiation pattern ranges, a dielectric high-altitude corona test chamber, and a complete array of associated equipment and accessories. In addition to anechoic chambers, provide reflection-free areas for microwave, frequency, antenna, and radome measurement. Convair also has a complete microwave laboratory and a full complement of supporting facilities that include plastic fabrication, integrated circuit fabrication, a model shop, and test and instrumentation laboratories. Electromagnetic compatibility, or EMC, is an essential attribute of an electronically complex system. Convair EMC engineers have participated in a wide range of programs involving aircraft, ships, weaponry, and electronic products. For over a decade, the EMC group has performed company and customer-funded R&D, which has had a profound influence on industry-wide EMC specifications and standards. EMC group facilities, among the most extensive in industry, are designed and equipped to detect and analyze interference, man-made or natural. A major component of Convair's broad capability is the geomagnetic test facility, constructed from completely non-magnetic materials. The facility's volume capacity of nearly 125 cubic feet provides a unique laboratory where a magnetic field can be reduced to zero or to any specified value up to one gauss. Some specific uses for the facility include testing electronic components, packages, and systems, entire spacecraft, underwater magnetic sensors, ASW systems, including magnetic anomaly detection, and evaluating the magnetic properties of materials, including effects of forming and machining. Complete facilities for aerodynamic testing of subsonic models of aircraft with high power-to-weight ratios are available in the Convair low-speed wind tunnel. Within the primary test section, a model or component can be tested at speeds up to 300 miles per hour. The secondary test section is designed for testing high lift configurations at speeds up to 70 miles per hour. Six component force data recorded on data cards are reduced by computer to coefficient form and plotted by machine. Final tabulations are available within 15 minutes after a test run. Electrical system mock-up System compatibility and engineering evaluation testing is performed in the electrical test facility. Complete power and distribution systems, including the influence of ground plane characteristics, 
are simulated to provide realistic configurations for meaningful evaluation. This may include racks, panels, wiring harnesses, and utilization equipment in production configurations. Variable electrical load banks provide normal and abnormal system loading. Active and passive controls and protective functions and devices are critically analyzed to assure a fully coordinated electrical system and complete compliance with customer and conveyor specifications. The flight test instrumentation checkout station provides an efficient and rapid means of conducting acceptance tests of airborne instrumentation systems before installation in aircraft, monitors and records data transmitted from test aircraft, and processes quick look data for research and development test evaluation. Flight test data is usually acquired by telemetry or direct recording aboard the aircraft. The station can record up to four telemetry RF links and can real-time monitor as many as 56 data channels at one time. Convair has logged a tremendous amount of telemetry experience, particularly in the area of new system design. Especially developed for an Office of Naval Research Marine project, this mobile telemetry and data station contains a computer and long-range, high-frequency telemetry equipment. It can travel almost anywhere in the world, wherever mobility plays a part in telemetry. Facilities of the structure's laboratories include extensive loading, heating, and data recording equipment, and a staff of engineers and technicians thoroughly experienced in all phases of structural testing. Primarily, two modes are conducted here, static testing and fatigue testing. The main goal is to prove the design, to make sure that the article is structurally satisfactory under actual applied loads. Developmental tests help finalize designs. Structural qualification testing certifies that exacting customer specifications are met. Problems developed during flight tests are also carefully simulated and analyzed so corrective measures may be taken. Convair continues to make significant advances in integrated land, sea, air, and space systems. The support groups you have just seen are among many playing a vital role in these programs.